I shoot a lot of weddings and lifestyle portraiture with a 7D. And as a still image photographer using a digital SLR, which shoots great HD video, I've decided it's a good idea at this point to start learning how to use motion in my wedding shoots. And in music videos, fashion videos, documentary shoots, I'm really kind of inspired to try a lot of new things right now. The thing is, I'd like to give my clients and myself something more than just standard filming from a tripod. I want to make cinematography that's interesting. I want to be able to move the camera like a pro, but I am on a budget. So I was doing some research online. I was checking to see what was available as far as linear tracks go. And what I found was pretty expensive, seemed really bulky, heavy, way too much investment for what I was trying to do. I decided on the Jack Russell backpack model from PuppyRail.com. At less than four pounds and 28 inches long, it's the most portable. I can take this rail anywhere I need to go. You can order a three foot, four foot, five foot, or even custom length rail from PuppyRail.com. It was really great to get the rail fully assembled in less than 10 minutes out of the box. I was ready to make my first moving shot pretty much immediately. The basic setup is really easy. You just place the puppy rail on any surface. You set up your level with the four adjustable feet and lock the four nuts for stability. You just mount a quick release on the carriage, which you may already own for your camera and tripod. Tracking shots are easy once you get the hang of the sliding motion. You should always use a wide angle lens. I use my 17 to 40 set at 17 millimeters. So here's my first setup and my first results. I was just looking around my studio and seeing what there was in my immediate surroundings. It's amazing how dynamic things can appear with this really simple motion. I'm really inspired by what I came up with. When I start experimenting with it, there's some great effects I can get with diagonal angles, upward slopes. I can mount a ball head on the cart and add some flexibility for changing the angle of the camera view. The cart is self-cleaning and it's self-lubricated, so there's always a smooth motion. And I can adjust the motion tension with the four screws on the side of the cart, and I found this to be really helpful to steady the motion. I'm really excited about the shots I'm getting with the Jack Russell from PuppyRail.com. I can think of a thousand applications with it. Soon there'll be a motorized version which will allow me to work with stop motion, time-lapse cinematography, and animation. Puppy Rail is the only slider with full synchronization with the most popular HD SLRs, which means the camera exposure is fully synchronized with the automated cart movement. I realize that only Puppy Rail offers so many great features for the best value. I'm going to stick with Puppy Rail, and you should try it too.